Mr. Oliver Oji's four children were attacked by a 70-year-old neighbor who used cutlass on them, killing two in the process while the other two were hospitalized. Mr. Aji said the corpse of the two boys deposited at the Stella Basanjo Hospital Mark have accumulated some bills, making it difficult to take them for burial. Mr. Aji, who appealed to well-meaning individuals and corporate organizations to come to his aid, said one of the two girls receiving treatment at UBTH has been discharged with a total bill of 200,000 Naira. But because he is unable to afford the bill, the girl has remained in the hospital, while the other, goodness Oliver, whose hand was chopped off, is slated for surgery and needed to pay some amount of money before the operation could be carried out. As this thing can happen for me, so me I no get money. The other, the, the senior, my senior daughter, gift, they don't discharge her, but I no see money to pay. Even the other one, where they cut head, cut hand through it. Then they won't do um, they won't do the hunt, but uh, money where they write for me. I no see money. Even drug where they write for me, I no see money. I beg government to help me. As I day here now, nothing, nothing for me. I beg the big way they won't give me the bill too much. Earlier in a telephone interview, the Edo State Police Commissioner, Mr. Falonsho Adebanjo, assured that the command is doing everything necessary to declare the seventy year old man who unleashed the attack on the children wanted. Pius Nsogo reporting.